CG, hi guys, my name is Yonwei and welcome to this new Blender tutorial about synchronizing a mouth. CGI guys, once again, uh, welcome to this new Blender tutorial where we today gonna automatically synchronize a mouth uh, with wrinkles we're using wrinkle maps. We're gonna create ourselves too. Um, let's begin. So the first thing I want to do is introduce you to this new character called Froy. It's the main character of uh, my animation that is still in the making. Um, the textures are quite bad because I just textured it for uh, this tutorial. But it's uh, good for now, and uh, let's go to the first step. So the first thing we're going to do is select our model. Make sure you did that. And we go to this tab and apply a shape key. It's going to be a basic shape key. Then we're going to apply another one. And we go press tab. And in edit mode, we're going to open the mouth. Now, if you go back to object mode, you can, com and we're going to name this real quick, um, open and clo close, and now you have a shape key where you can open and close the mouth, Blah. open and close the mouth. Okay, let's synchronize this to our audio file. To do that, we go to the uh, graphic editor. And then we're going to hover above this value and we're going to press I to set a keyframe. Make sure your uh, timeline is on null. Then we're going to say key bake sound to V curves. Going to select our audio. And as you can see right here, there is now an automatically synchronized mouth. So let's play it as. CG, hi guys, my name is Yonwei and welcome to this new Blender tutorial about synchronizing a mouth. So, it's actually looking kind of bad. It's just opening and closing and everyone knows a mouth doesn't speak like that. So, first of all, I want to exaggerate this open and uh, mouth. So, first of all, I want to exaggerate this open and closing. So, we're going to add a modifier, envelope. And then we're going to set at the beginning, add point. Then we're going to tweak these values a little bit to create an exaggerated V curve. Mm, like that. So it has to be closed at the beginning. CG high guy. This is a little bit too much. Oh. CG, hi guys, my name is Yonwe and welcome to this new Blender tutorial about synchronizing a mouth. Perfect, that's great. Let's add some other shape keys to uh, form the mouth. Okay, we're gonna press plus to apply another one and we're gonna say, name it, O mouth. This represent a round circle. So uh, we're gonna make this mouth a circle in edit mode. Let's see, little time lapse coming in. So for the cheeks I'm gonna use a little trick. I uh, made it like this. So it's going upwards, but if you set this range value to minus one, you can not only go upwards, but also downwards. So that's really useful. So what I'm going to do next is I'm going to synchronize the mouth form. And there is no automatic way to do this, so I'm going to just keyframe it. Um, what I'm going to do is, if I say like something like C, G, I, guys, C, I need to form the mouth like it's saying an E. So uh, I'm going to do this with the shape keys. 
and uh, you have to do this manually so uh, this is gonna take a little bit of time but this is so easy and you it's it's you can do it really quickly it's not that it's not that hard so I'll see you in a second So I've gone ahead and this is what I created. CG Hi guys, my name is Yonwe and welcome to this new Blender tutorial about synchronizing a mouth. So that was the tutorial for now. Next week we're gonna cover the wrinkle parts and I'll see you then.